Hello and welcome to Kahindo Tech. In this video, I'll show you how to create an account on the NBA app. But before I begin, please allow me to give a quick 10 second shout out to my merch store. I work with different artists to create cool and original fan art. I sell clothes, pillows, and many different accessories. Please check out my store to support the channel and the artists I work with. You can find a link to my store on the top of the comment section or the description of this video. Thanks, you can now get back to your video. We'll begin by opening up the NBA app. As you see, this is how the app looks like. So once you have it opened, it usually looks like this and you can just tap it to skip all of that. And then uh, the first time that you open it, you have to agree to their uh, cookie policy. So I'll click on uh, agree here. And then if you look over here on the bottom, actually up here, on the top right corner, you see this icon right here? You want to tap on that. <clears throat> and then from here, you get the option of creating an account. So we'll click on that. OK, I'm going to enter all this information. So first, you enter your email, password, first name, last name, date of birth, year, and all of this. First, I just enter my email. And then, so after you enter your email, go ahead and type in your password and pay attention here where they're saying that password has to be at least eight characters long. It must include at least three of the following four. So you have to have at least uh, three of these in uppercase letter, lowercase letter, number, special character, not be compromised of obvious keywords, not include guessable data such as personal information, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, so just, uh, I usually just like to put in some word and then put in a number, a special character, and make sure one of the letters is a capital letter in lowercase. Just follow all of these, uh, all these instructions. So I'll go ahead and create my password. And I'm guessing this will probably be hidden from you guys. Okay. And I followed all those rules. And then I'm going to enter uh, the name. And then put in a birthday. Now, uh, what year should I put? And this is not my real birthday, by the way. Okay, and then put in your postal code. And you can, if you're not from the US, so if you're from the US, just select US. If you're not from the US, uh, click on this drop down. So right there. And then you can select all these other countries. But since I'm from the US, I'll just leave that. And I'm going to put in my postal code. Okay. And then over here, I'll click where it says, uh, do I agree with the terms and services? I click on OK. Then I'm going to click over here where it says, uh, create account. And then usually they want you to select your uh, top uh, favorite teams. Uh, let's go with the champions. Oh, there are the Lakers right there. Okay. These are notifications. And you can select any of these that you want or just click on next on the bottom over here. So I'll click on next. Uh, Server is not available. Please check what? That was weird. Uh, not now. Oh, yeah, that error was weird. But as you can see, my account is already created right here. Uh, and that's how you create your account on the NBA app. So now I've successfully created an account. If I look over here in the upper right hand corner, if I tap there again, you see that my account is there. That's how you create the account. If you have any other questions or comments, please leave them in the comment section below. And thank you so much for watching.